Hi, in this video, we're gonna see the MOSFETs, the 8 pin MOSFETs. Okay, so as you can see here, basically, the 8 pin MOSFETs, as you can see, contain 3 pins for source. As you can see here, these 3 pins are connected together to the ground. As you can see here, we have the path here to the ground. This is the gate. Okay, and here we have 4 pins that are connected together. As you can see, the drain. Okay, here. As you can see, we have another MOSFET. We have the, the dot here means the first pin, or the white mark means the first pin. So the three pins, the first pin, second and third is the source, the fourth is the gate, and the other fourth, I mean five, six, seven, eight, is for the drain. Okay? So here also, as you can see, we have the white mark here means this is the pin number one. The three pins are for source, as you can see. Okay? for source this is the gate the fourth pin and we have the drain here also connected here also this is the drain as you can see four pins connected together as you can see in accordance with the, the path in the motherboard here this is the source and this is the gate okay so let's use the multimeter let's select first the continuity option or the buzzer option or in some multimeter the diode option and check this MOSFETs so let's check whether the source terminals are connected together okay so let's check for the continuity this is the drain as you can see four as you can see the four terminals should be connected together as you can see let's check these three leads this is source also, these three LEDs should be connected together, as you can see. Okay. This is the gate. The gates should not be connected neither to the source nor to the gate or to the drain. The gates, let's check the gate with the source, no continuity. Let's check it with the drain, no continuity. Also, the source with the drain should not be connected together. If you find any continuity or any buzzer option, means the MOSFET is bad. Here, as you can see, we have other MOSFETs. As you can see, I will show you the difference between... Normally, for this MOSFET, we have here U. Normally, U is for IC, but for this MOSFET, we have U. But usually the MOSFET has Q reference. As you can see, this is not MOSFET, this is the BIOS. Always you should differentiate between the MOSFET and the BIOS. The BIOS IC is bigger than the MOSFET in terms of shape.